What's good? What's good? Welcome to the Epic Entertainment Critics. I'm Antoine. And I'm still James. Okay, we're checking out some trailers. Uh, Disney Plus is on a tear right now. <laughs> they, uh, <laughs> they dropped the Obi-Wan, the Andor, and, and also the Willow. Uh, this is going to be in the vein of Top Gun, where it's a 30 years later, this is the sequel. Mm. I think this is going to be a series um, on a, or a mini series or something that's going to be on Disney Plus. Which is cool. Um, I think that movie came out eighty six, around the same time. Mm. Um, but um, as you said right before we was about to watch this, you haven't seen Willow. That was Willow was one of my favorite movies growing up, man. It was uh, Warwick Davis is, um, of course, everybody know he's a, a little person, and he been as the leprechaun he been he plays so the many professor things professor flitwick in the harry potter movies yeah he plays so many things but willow well, he was only like 18 he was real young when he did willow mm-hmm. um but yeah willow is a good adventure fantasy movie for me i heard a lot of people talking oh willow was crap you know what hmm. if you thought willow was crap you just don't know how to enjoy movies <laughs> that's what i think man cuz i feel like that was a fun adventure movie, especially if you a kid, you can enjoy it. I thought I just think it's enough for all ages. I've yet to speak to anyone who's seen it who didn't like it. So I just heard a lot of people kind of trash it yeah. uh, because um, I don't. I think they just to be hating on uh, George Lucas because George Lucas, uh, I think he wrote this and he didn't direct it though. Mm. Uh, I think Ron Howard directed this. Directed, oh. directed Willow. Okay. So I like Willow. I love Willow growing up. Um, but I know a lot of people talking about it wasn't good, but pfft, whatever. <laughs> this is going to be the sequel. I don't know what they're going to do. You know, Val Kilmer was in there, so I'm pretty sure he's not going to be in this. Well, I'm definitely going to watch it before. Mad Mordek and Val Kilmer was the, he basically was like Han Solo. Hmm. He was like the, the cool swashbuckling guy while Willow was kind of like Luke, I guess. <laughs> um, but I remember they said that, what's name of had the, um, uh, George Lucas said he had a, uh, a story of a village full of small people. That was going to be the original premise for Star Wars, huh? which is like, his mind be all over the place. I don't know how you got that from that, but whatever. <laughs> uh, so Willow was kind of like the ideas he had mm-hmm. that he kind of like stored and then just made this later. Uh, but, uh, you know, it was re- it was real good. So, Let's watch this trailer and um, see, have a little discussion for what we see. So without further ado, Willow, just Willow. They don't call it like Willow the the return or whatever, just Willow. The story continues. Which is cool. <laughs> All right. <laughs> there is a story of a child destined to be an empress and the unlikely hero. Who would protect her? There is a balance between all things. Light and shadow. Good and evil. When that balance is upset, universe corrects the world needs you again it needs your magic into the unknown (laughs) that's where we must go <laughs> I'll, I'll say this much. If none of us, I'm glad I got to watch you watch that. <laughs> Dude, look. All you Lord of the Rings people, all you Witcher with all that stuff. Oh, I know about this. I know about this. I know about this. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll tell you what, man. Some of the some of the CGI look kind of not so great, but guess what? It's still, I'm, I'm still there. It, 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 it's still, it did, it did something for me. They finally made one for you. <laughs> for me, for me, man. <laughs> um, 
I I I like I like where it, it looks like it's picking up where the last one left off. I like Ward Davis. He he still looked good for his age. Um, it's all you Harry Potter people. I'm putting Willow up against Harry Potter. Willow wins. Really? Oh, okay. Yeah, well, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't uh, expecting. I was expecting some pushback on that. <laughs> uh, no, well, uh, you know, Willow was a was a wizard in training on the on the movie. You should go back and watch that. I don't know when they said it come out. Uh, what did it say? Uh, whenever. November. Ooh, we got a while. We got a while. We got a while. So uh, we'll, we'll have to. We'll have, We'll have to do. Uh, I'll have to get Willow in. The yeah, original. man, we will go ahead and do a review for the whole one. Maybe if I go back and watch it, I'll be like, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't watch it. <laughs> <laughs> well, like I, I was, I was talking to somebody the other day, and they were talking about uh, something. I think it was an anime they had watched growing up, and they was like, I've never gone back and watched it. No, it was Dragon Heart. Uh-huh. It, it's like I thought that movie was perfect. You're talking about the movie with um, uh, what's the name as the dragon? Uh, um. Uh, um, I don't, I don't, I don't remember who played the dragon. James uh, Bond, the first James Bond. Connery. Yes. No. Sean Connery as yeah. the dragon voice. Sure. Yeah, that sounds right. And Dennis Quaid, I believe. Was yeah. The, yeah. Yeah. And uh, there was one. I was like, and I refused to go back and watch it because what if I was wrong? <laughs> And it wasn't as perfect as I thought it was as a kid. I don't want to ruin oh, the memory of that thing. Because when you're a kid, you forgive all the crap. But yeah. when you get older, you see all the bull crap <laughs> and understand things. <laughs> Woo. You know what? Some things are best left in your memories. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, because I, I tried to put somebody on something a while back. I don't even remember what it was. Like, no, you're going to love it. It's amazing. It's it's perfect. The characters are great. And then we're watching, I'm like, this, this is not what I remember. Look, man, I'll tell you like this, man. Willow was a fun movie, man. Um and I really like um I really I really like the fact that Ward Davis get to be a star of mm-hmm. his own thing, you know. And we actually got a real little person instead of them trying to like CGI make them, right, make uh, 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 pull uh what's a them, right, make them look little, you know. We really got a little person get some shine, you know. And um and you know, nobody better than Ward Davis because Leprechaun is my shit. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I, I really, I really uh, dig what I saw there. Uh, yeah. uh, I was, can't wait till it come out, but it's a minute for it come out. Yeah, but uh, got a few months there. Yeah, <laughs> but yeah, it looks fun, man. Uh, can't wait to see that. And uh, what did you think of what you saw? Even though it, you lo- it looks, it looks great. It looks like my kind of movie. Right. It's, it's definitely fantasy and. Like you know, that sort of wizardry like wizardry and all that stuff, like little swashbuckling. High, oh yeah, like now I'm not sure fantasy. how they're gonna see. Val Kilmer did the swashbuckling stuff, and since I'm pretty sure he's not gonna be in this, right? I wonder how they're gonna make up for that character. Is it gonna be his son or something? Yeah. They'd be like, you know, that's how they do. But the right, one yeah. guy kind of looked like him, almost like a look a younger version of him. Right. They had a guy in there with a sword. Let me see if I can find him. I was like, yeah, he looked. I bet you that's the Val Kilmer. Character Mad Mardikin. Well, I don't know, but it was good because it worked. The, I, the, yeah, that's the guy. The story, like maybe that's his son or something. Anyway, the story was it was a baby, and they had to get the baby to the kingdom uh, because it, and and the evil witch had wanted to, to kill the baby because he was the rightful heir to the throne or whatever. Thank you. So they once they got the baby there or whatever, now we get to see her grow up and. You know, um, now now there's a new problem, right? But you're right, right? But uh, it was uh, it was like th- that movie left off at where it left off at a good, it left off at a good point where thirty years later we can see what's going on. Right. This way they left off on that, so I like that. Anyway, uh, that is Willow. Um, it's coming out way in November, so <laughs> hopefully we don't forget like about almost <laughs> October, <laughs> right? Yeah. All right, so yeah, I mean, uh, almost December, rather. It's yeah. like, was it the 29th, they said? The 30th. Jeez. <laughs> so, so practically December. Yeah. All right, so um, thanks for checking out the video. And please subscribe to the channel if you like our content. Uh, and hit that bell icon so you get alerts in time we post new videos or we live stream. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up down below. And hit us up in the comments what fantasy movie do you think deserves a 30 years later style sequel? <laughs> uh, maybe legend
Remember Legend? Yeah. Tom Cruise, but no. Not with Tom, Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise going to come back again. Nah. You know what? <laughs> <Yeah>. Cut it. <laughs> Cut yeah. Don't I give remember that Legend power. being good I, 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 as a kid, but I yeah. don't know if it holds up. But whatever. Yeah. But, you know, Tom be like, well, let's make it about me. I wonder what he'd be back. What he'd be ready, willing to do? Probably. <laughs> Wait, look, I'm, I'm gonna need some armor. I'm gonna need a sword. Yeah. It's, it's my time. All right, y'all. We out of here. Peace, y'all. Peace.